A woman accused of participating in an illegal abortion had her first pre-trial hearing this morning. 3 News Now reporter Alex Whitney spoke with the prosecutor in the case and brings us the latest from Madison. Celeste Burgess, the young woman who, along with her mother, has been accused of being involved in an illegal abortion, made an appearance in court this morning, solidifying the dates for when she will return for her trial. According to court documents, Celeste allegedly gave birth to a stillborn child sometime during the night of April 22nd. Prosecutors believe Celeste and her mother then burned and buried the fetus. Celeste is being charged with concealing the death of another person, providing false information, and improper disposal of human skeletal remains. Abortions, I don't think, are usual in Nebraska, but certainly at that stage, it's different in protection for that. Smith says he has submitted evidence in this case that shows Celeste was around 29 weeks pregnant when she gave birth to the stillborn. Much of the evidence in the case comes from the form of Facebook messages sent between Celeste and her mother, where they discussed what medication to take to abort the fetus. Facebook's decision to provide the messages to law enforcement has garnered national attention, but Smith says it's common to search social media. Uh, our experience, not just in this case, and experience generally is that uh, you know, people uh, share things on social media that they wouldn't share otherwise. Celeste is scheduled to appear in court again for a pretrial conference on September 26th, and her trial will begin on November 14th. From Madison, Alex Whitney, 3 News Now. Celeste's mother will have a similar hearing on Friday.